For this longtime number one doubles team, this tournament was the most important prize that had eluded them. After 15 years on tour at 34 years old, Bob and Mike Bryan broke through their last remaining barrier in 2013, breathing a sigh of relief as they hoisted the trophy of the tournament the Southern California natives first started coming to as kids. Good to get that monkey off our back. That was the, kind of the last tournament we had never won and uh, yeah. finally did it, felt good. Yeah, I mean, we had a hell of a year last year, but that was probably one of our big highlights is uh, getting this monkey off our back and winning the tournament that we, you know, kind of fell in love with tennis. Um, coming down here when we were 10 years old, saw Agassi, all the great champions, and um, one of the reasons why we want to become pros. Their 94 career titles make them the winningest men's doubles team of all time. They have 15 Grand Slam titles, winning all four of them more than once. On court, they have little left to prove. On stage with the Bryan Brothers Band, they say expectations are different. But when Bob sat at the keyboard and Mike played guitar for a performance here at the tennis garden, fans seem to enjoy their musical talents just as much as their tennis. You know, no one's really expecting much out of us on stage. So everyone's, you know, kind of surprised. Whoa, the Bryans play music? So, uh, you know, we're, we're kind of, I don't know, we're just surprising, I guess, a bunch of people. That's a, a big thrill for us. We always look forward to going out to the food court and kind of rocking out there. We always play with the drummer from the Counting Crows, uh, Jim Bogios, who kind of carries us. But uh, yeah, we're gonna do it next year. We've done it already for five years. And uh, yeah, out here, it's, a, it's more business. You know, this pays the bills. Music creates bills. The twins owe much of their success to each other. But Mike boasts that he has the upper hand between them in titles won. We played almost a thousand matches on tour. And uh, you know, I think I've played maybe 10 matches with other, other guys. It's actually worked out well for me. I'm uh, two for two without this guy. Two for four, buddy. Two for four. Uh, Won two more titles. I don't think he's ever going to catch me. I've so, only played one match with anyone else. John Isner Davis Cup uh, a few years ago. We got the W, but uh, I think we'd be okay with other guys. Yeah, I would be okay. You need me. I don't need you. <laughs> <laughs>